What is up, guys? It's the Kilograms. We're back with another episode of Trailmakers World Record Attempts 2019. We're currently fourth. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to see if we can do better. We uh, we lost a subscriber today. So, RIP. Hardly knew you. I guess they just didn't want Trailmakers content coming to them daily. <laughs> If you do want Trailmakers content coming to you daily, <laughs> you know what to do. Right mittens, exactly. They should like and subscribe. Yes, they should. And if they hit that notification bell three times, well, you'll just have to try it and find out. Uh, so we're trying to build this lighter. Um, I really like these here. But I wonder if we can, hmm, because we're already four, so we got it. Okay, uh, you know, our design is decent, but it just needs. Okay, so we're at one hundred fifteen. Um, can I chop these off? One hundred thirteen, <laughs> and see if we can still. So uh, somebody suggested that I do like a uh, spoiler on the front here. Um, I might actually do a spoiler underneath here and see like what type of lift it generates. Um, I don't think just doing that's gonna have much of an effect. I like how these are connected, that's good. I could maybe move these in slightly, but I don't wanna get too carried away with that. Um, let's just see if it still actually works. At a certain point, it's going to end up just being a, uh, whoop. It's going to end up being a plane. And I do want to build one of those, but I think I want to design it slightly different. Um, actually, if I chop those wings off and just mounted them on top, that might not make a bad plane. But I need control surfaces and everything, so, you know. Oh, I love how this starts. Wait, that was my best? Really? That doesn't seem right. And this is not really cooperating very well. But that's super weird that I had a different vehicle. Oh, yeah, it handles different because it, it's completely, yeah, okay, all right. So it was stable before, and now it's not. So clearly, <laughs> what I was actually going to do, now that I remember, um, I wanted to go beat the uh, the other, uh, oh no, Mittens is going to come over here, the other course with this vehicle, <laughs> the other water course. cruise on over there <laughs> yeah this is much better I love it hopefully we have enough steering power I could always just put more um, wings on oh this is gonna be insane I forgot how fast this was <laughs> perfect oh okay I need to get like this much closer. Okay, so I'm already 13th. Wow. Okay, so I think now I can spawn my guy in here. Hope it doesn't break. Oh. Let's just start over. Okay. Beautiful. This is gonna be fun. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, boy. Oh, that's actually a decent craft that I had. Well, compared to... Whoa! <laughs> I can mess up that bad and still demolish everybody. We're getting to the point where this is getting ridiculous. See, all it takes is practice. Wow, are we going to get under a minute? Is that second in the world? Probably not. 
third, though. I need an air horn sound. Anybody I know? SF Grenade, okay. Not by much, though. 13 seconds, though. Oh, man. That is wild. How fast could you be going? <laughs> I really want to kind of redesign this a little bit, but I can beat. Okay, so we're going to beat the next guy, and then we're going to, because I'll have a better start. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he's got a super light craft. Wow. That's what we're going to have to do to compete, so... Gotta miniaturize. Like, I'm thinking just start over from from that <laughs> propulsion and work my way up from there. Maybe I'll keep the hinge. <laughs> Where the hinge is here. Ah, oh, these are Yeah, buddy. I think that is too out of the world now. Oh yeah. Ah <laughs> <sighs> it feels good. Steel rain. Okay. So we got to cut off a significant amount and still just have one engine. All right. <laughs> Man, what can I even do? Okay, so it takes a couple of those to stay up. You know what? I think it's just better if I... Start here. And just hmm. so we'll do that. I think what we need. Hopefully, there's enough space, um, or I could maybe do some weird stuff on the front here. Um, but I want to make sure. <laughs> okay, we already cut the weight in half. I want to make sure that um, like this can actually pop up out of the water versus just like being, you know what I mean. I know what I mean. Like that it doesn't need to be up on a, a raised area. Um, so we'll have to see. I'm going to have to put these, aren't I, on the front here. I don't like it, but. Yeah, how would I? I could jettison. Yeah, okay, all right, all right. In the name of... But I shouldn't have to jettison them all. Oh, here we go, perfect. I may just jettison these. If I, you know, once I pop out of the water, just drop them off, that would be super cool. That would be so gangster. <laughs> just drop them off. Oh. What? How was that connected? Weird. Um, I don't know if I should really... I think it does kind of have to be at the long end of a pendulum. That's, that's what I've been experiencing so far. Actually, let's just see if this floats. Let's just... Oh. <laughs> ah, do I have to... Oh, here we go. I was going to say, do I have to step back through all that? Oh. Well, okay. Wait, how was it even connected before? Oh, did I like move something over? I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so let's try. <laughs> we could always, ooh. Super light, actually. Spoilers might be the key here. I do not know how powerful they are, but that's what we're gonna find out because this might be an extremely good idea do like two because then I don't I think these downward fins count as uh, stabilization as well I believe 
Um, I could be completely wrong. I have been wrong before. Well, I thought I was wrong, but I was just mistaken. <laughs> okay, let's... Ha, a trailer hinge might actually be really good for a... Or a, a large hinge, actually, not an actual trailer hinge. Yeah, that's kind of unfortunate. Oh, well, we'll figure it out. Okay. So, I think I just need the, just two of these, two of these guys. Or, I think this would be cooler. <laughs> How cool is that? I really want to shorten it. Let's see what happens. Oh, I should have known. even off center now okay let's try this I don't want to like depend on these pontoons I might have to again but you know we'll see I think that might be an okay place for that nice and if I have to do a couple of those that would be kind of cool too all right let's check it out oof <laughs> uh, okay, so I guess I can't just hold it down anymore. This is awful. Why does it think that one's my best? That wasn't my best. Was that really me, like, a week ago? Okay, well we have a we have a benchmark. Um I don't like how it completely pulls me under though, so I'm gonna like double these up. And I'm gonna try shortening it again. I know it didn't work out before, but there's a whole new, completely new design, so we can mess with it a lot and mess with other parts of it to make it. Um I am also going to do that. Woo! She's a feisty one. Not enough though. Okay, so yeah, I know I'll get kicked out of the race. I need to make this angle much. Let's just go. I don't. Whatever. Um, should be faster. I also have to reverse it. <laughs> That's probably more important. Um, maybe these don't work in water. <laughs> that might be that might be a thing. But I should hit like a point where I like come out of the. Water. Yeah, this is. Let's swap them for the other. I saw a comment today, and it said, "What did it say?" Something about, uh, using, um, alternative things on here, uh, like armor plates. I'm interested in that idea, but I'm going to do that on a car because this is reliable for me right now. So I want to kind of keep the propulsion unit <laughs> doing its thing, you know, I think that's the right direction. It looks like the right direction anyway. Just need to hit that magical speed or we come up out of that water. Turning seems no. Okay. <laughs> I don't think the turning is low enough. Oh, here we go. If I the wrong direction. 
Okay. I'm gonna take these off. I think they are mostly adding weight. And the arrow is secondary to that at this point. Come on. Just gotta pop up out of that water. Okay. Maybe I need... Yeah, this might turn into a traditional plane in a, in a quick second here. But actually, no, it'll be ground effect, 100%. There. No, I need to get air underneath there. That's what we need. Maybe I'll slide it forward later to make it more stable. This is... There we go. Let's try this out. <laughs> it works. It's a plane, though. <laughs> okay <laughs> so that's not going to be it but actually now I'm curious about well let's try a little wing first that make the most logical sense but I would like to try that um, whatchamacallit again that didn't do anything. Nice. Yep. <laughs> it's weird that it's showing that one. As my as my best, huh? Maybe we maybe need a couple more wings. Just a little bit more lift here. Ooh, let's try here. I like I like here. This looks good. I don't want it to take off, but I want it to be out of the water. Okay, I think I need to bring those up a little bit. Okay, it's it's pretty good though. It's all right. Um. Okay, so let's move these up one. Hopefully we still catch that air, but then maybe we'll actually come out of the water. And maybe I'll move the center of lift forward here. Interesting. Let's change one thing at a time. Crazy. Huh. Okay. Let's... Could just move this back. <laughs> I don't know if we need this. Well, here, actually, let's do this. What? Oh. <clears throat> I just wanted to barely have lift. We're, it feels like we're close. <laughs> oh, it's not going to float now. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, we're never going to win a race like that. I'm going to have to, for the... Oh, my God. <laughs> for any uh, plane stuff, I'm definitely going to have to... Um... Ooh, actually, hear my work. Uh, I'm going to have to make that thing on a toggle because there's no way. Like, I can't. I don't know, maybe I will have to put it on a separate control, we'll see. But like, I wanna not, I just wanna turn the engine on and not touch it, cause if you do, that crazy UFO effect happens. Maybe I can learn how to harness that, I don't think so, but. <laughs> Does that mean it works? <laughs> too well um and just yeets off in the atmosphere uh maybe I, now i can take these ones off and maybe oh that's what i should really do <laughs> can you hear the humming i love it okay Because this whole thing is an assembly. I don't know why I haven't been like literally just doing that instead of having a whole extra set of. Maybe because I was moving it back and forth. That's probably why. Okay, so let's. That might work. Care for the all try. Ooh. Still too much. Let's move the wings backwards so that our uh, our lift is more. Oh god, our lift is more centered than. Uh, I think the pontoons are okay. all the way back. That looks kind of cool. <laughs> that looks really cool. <laughs> Hopefully it actually works. A little too much, but this is actually probably a pretty good design for a plane. Wow! If I didn't have to hold that button down, we'd be doing pretty well here. There we go. Does this actually work? Does it just switch directions depending on your... Somebody's got to do like a technical paper on this thing. It's probably going to be me. <laughs> Any volunteers in the comments who want to explain how this works? Um, okay, so we still had way too much lift. Oh, you know what we could do? <laughs> Yep, we're gonna make it super small. We're just, we're going all out. It's happening. Okay. I still think this is okay, that's fine. I'll leave that. But, actually, uh, I'm thinking I could put this up here. My issue is it it like jolts forward a lot. So I'm kind of concerned about that. But maybe that was, I don't know. Maybe with the wings so far back, they won't catch as much and that they'll be fine. <laughs> oh, this is so funny looking. I love it. I might be able to put wings on the front too if this doesn't cut it, you know. Ooh.
Okay. Too far back. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense, but I kind of like how it looks. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense at all. Yeah, I should have known. <laughs> Fine, I'll put one back here. Okay. <laughs> So, I don't think the problem is that it, that it dips. He says as he dips. Man. It is the problem with the dipping. That That is the real issue here. Because if the wings come up that far, this is definitely... Okay. So I think what I need to do is just try and get up to that speed without holding it down, unfortunately. trick is not to fly at all I don't know it doesn't seem right but that might actually get us to what we're, we're I mean we're just trying to beat the next guy that we don't have to fly if it's not Jeez. Yeah, this thing just pulls back too hard to do that No, it's got to be, like, there's too much. It, it affects the, the system too much. It needs to be bigger. <sighs> hmm. Or, well, here, let's try this. Let's mess with this for the first time in forever. Um, and move the angle to, sure, 12.0. I don't know. We're just doing it. And then I'm gonna paint paint the vehicle so I know it's super experimental and I need to take a different vehicle if I want different settings. Okay. So we turn the angle of the of the thrust down. Still shoots us underwater. <laughs> Maybe that's the key. <laughs> okay. Another redesign. Real quick. We're not going to make this episode extremely long, but I really want to explore this. I really wanted to go back to, uh, maybe. I really wanted to go back to, oh, a motorcycle seat. Oh, we couldn't make it centered. That ruins so much stuff. Um, how do I build this from this perspective? Uh... <laughs> Let's try it. Let's try it anyway. Even though it probably won't work. I'm also confused though. If the angle of the... Yeah, we're gonna... I think we're gonna have to go back to a... That's not right. Um, Back to the drag race pretty soon. Because uh, I want to try out different like engine designs and kind of mess with that a little bit. Um, because I want to fine tune that angle to get like the max stability. I guess it makes sense it flies right away, but like, man. 
spoilers? Would spoilers help me in this instance? Or like weights at the front that I can drop off? I don't know. <laughs> times are times are desperate. I want to get first in the world. Let's you know. All right. Let's see what happens here. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try like tapping it. It just it's got so much leverage. It's it's tough. Okay. So it has to be bigger. That just that's a thing. It has to be bigger. There's no getting around that. It's gotta be able to counteract that. Just the flex of the whatchamacallit. I thought we were in a no flex zone, but here we are. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> I do like how fast it is. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, I really. Okay. I think with that problem, how we solve that is with more of these. Mm hmm right, because it'll stay above the water maybe? Actually, can I slide that back? I don't know if I should. Ooh, I can. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, I think we're gonna have to call the episode. I think I think I gotta. I mean, we did build a really good vehicle. I just I want to do slightly better by completely redesigning. We're gonna save this one too. Um, man, I guess is this the right one? I think so. What's the difference? maybe I guess we already built the ideal vehicle for this I don't know we're <laughs> let's do one more run let's do another run just because it's awesome I think it, this one just has to be like this big to be stable how are you doing it I wonder if he's using a regular engine no there's no way I gotta watch the replay on this one. Yeah, we're not doing so hot. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try and get a good look at, oh, is he gonna come around? He probably already finished. I didn't watch him close enough. I love how hard this turns. I didn't expect it to do this well on such a small course. Yeah, so next time I'll go back to the uh, drag strip for a while and uh, let's do some more UFO testing. You know, it's it has to be done. Somebody's got to break the ground in this in this field. You know, and I don't know if anybody else is doing it. So. This is weird. Does it not, wait, what? I'm trying to think, is it not like counting? <laughs> Half the time, man. <laughs> I'm trying to think how that would be possible. I could have the front, I don't know. We'll figure it out next time. <laughs> this has been the Kilograms, another episode of the Trailmakers World Record Attempts 2019. We're second in the world, that's not bad. <laughs> Make sure to check out the kilograms.com. More music, uh, motovlogs, merch. 
all sorts of stuff. And I will catch you guys next time. Peace.